Christmas is the time to really push out the boat. So if you're intending to spend £10,000 and you're looking for a necklace, here is our top lineup. Chomé, the Place Vendôme jeweller, is known for its very feminine designs and the newest collection is the Hortensia. Um, it's really beautiful, it's really light to wear, fashionably long and um, it's open work rose gold with tiny little Hortensia flowers. It's so pretty. De Beers has just brought out the Aria collection and the inspiration goes back to their reputation of being the jeweler of light. So what the designers have done is they've taken the way that light dances around a diamond and interpreted it in gold and of course diamonds. Measuring over a metre in length, the Piaget necklace, which the French call a sautoir when it's this length, is really distinctive. It's got the open work gold roses with a little diamond at the centre. The little design of the flowers with the diamond at the centre on each of them makes it like, you know, quite striking but easy as well. This necklace from Boodles from the Blossom Collection is set with almost one and a half carats of diamonds and it's really pretty how the little petal motifs are clustered together and all shimmering with diamonds. Blossom is a theme that Boodles have um, been using over the years and I like the way they've set this with diamonds but it sits quite high so it makes a, a nice statement. This little pendant by Graf features the firm's icon, which is a little fan shape. The diamonds are beautifully set. And what's more, even though it's quite petite, it really shines out, and that is because Graf is really an expert when it comes to diamonds. If you want to know all that's happening in the world of jewellery and watches, visit my website, thejewelleryeditor.com.